Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome Head of Global Marketing for the IT and Mobile Division, Young Hee Lee. Hello, everyone. Welcome to the GIS2 showcase at Berlin's iconic temperature. Last month at our event in New York, we teased an exciting new device. You may have guessed that it was something ahead of the curve. It takes bravery to stay ahead of the curve. It takes courage to bring something new to the market, even when everybody else is doing it another way. The Samsung philosophy is to push forward, embracing new adventures, and exploring the farthest frontiers of technology. Two years ago, we introduced the first gear, and we wanted to create a new wearable movement. We learned a lot along the way. From the start, we've known that our goal wasn't to replicate a luxury watch. We wanted to transcend that idea and bring you an advanced, smart, wearable device. That becomes a meaningful part of your life. We found our inspiration in a simple, perfect shape, a circle. The symbol of wholeness, focus, revolution, and completion. The circle is intuitive. And as your body just knows instinctively, a circle is functional. With every turn, your life gets better. That's why I'm pleased to introduce to you the GIS2. Thank you. We created two versions for two very different types of customers. The Gear S2 for sporty, active types, and the classic version for a more timeless look. Both versions are minimal, gender neutral, and modern. And now, let's invite Pranav Mistry to tell you more about the Gear S2. Thank you. Thank you for joining us tonight. I'm Pranav Mistri. The journey of creating Gear S2 was exciting. As Yonghee explained, the circle was our North Star in designing the Gear S2. The circle is at the center of his simple and practical design. Gear S2 is about a completely new way to interact. Now you can physically rotate the bezel. It, has, it also has that gentle ticking sensation when you rotate it. This new circular UX will remind you of, of turning a dial, like, like the volume control of a radio. It has that tangible feeling, the, the analog feeling. When you turn the bezel, your body registers the motion. It's called muscle memory. So now, without even looking at the screen, you can rotate the bezel, and you can find the app that you are looking for very quickly. 
But the circular bezel has another important advantage. When you use touch screen on other smartwatches, your finger blocks the screen, blocks the content beneath. How can I read a CNN headline if my finger is in the way? With Gear S2, the circular bezel let me interact from outside of the screen. So I can turn the bezel to read long emails and scroll through without looking at the screen. I can turn to navigate within apps, like browsing through reviews of nearby restaurants on Yelp. I can also simply turn the bezel to scroll through the scores of NBA games that I follow. Let's say, let's say I'm using a map. So instead of using fingers to pinch and zoom on a tiny real estate of the screen, I can use the bezel to zoom in and out. This is super intuitive. It's natural. Now, anyone who has ever owned and loved the Android phone knows that how important that little back button is. We have included a similar feature on Gear S2. This back button works along with the home key that you can program to open apps or press and hold for, for more options. So all of this ergonomically designed hardware, the bezel, the back and home, they work together seamlessly. For other smartwatch makers, this has been always a challenge. Some say that the combination of soft taps and hard taps or ETBT crown will make your life easier. But once you once you turn and swipe your way around the Gear S2, you will see how much fun it is to use. You will wonder how we lived without it. Now, another thing that differentiates the Gear S2 is that it's not made out of aluminum. It's made out of very strong stainless steel. Also, the elastomer watch bands on the Gear S2 are interchangeable. So you can match it to your style. You can also swap out the leather, leather band on the classic version because it's now compatible with any standard 20 mm watch band. We brought our advanced display technology as well to the Gear S2. It has vibrant 360 by 360 Super AMOLED circular display. And this display of Gear S2 is protected by scratch-proof, durable Gorilla Glass 3. There is bound to be a watch face that will delight you. I can't wait until you turn the bezel through all the colorful and creative watch face options that our designers have created. And of course, we are open to third-party watch faces. So we'll, you will have many more to choose from. And of course, so when engineering and design come together, a small miracle takes place. Mendini has brought his humor and sense of color to a series of artistic watch face and band options that are designed especially for Gear S2. We are leading the global standard when it comes to wearables. The Gear S2 can connect via 3G, Bluetooth, NFC, and Wi-Fi. It comes in two versions with two different ways to connect. As of now, the 3G version will be available in limited regions. The 3G version is a standalone device. It no longer needs a phone in your pocket. And we were able to make it surprisingly thin and light because it comes with a pre-installed eSIM. Like our Galaxy devices, Gear S2 also comes with advanced power saving mode. Let's say you completely forgot to charge your gear over the weekend. No problem. 
Turn on the power saving mode. You still be able to make calls, get notified through Bluetooth. The screen will render in grayscale, and your apps will have to wait a little longer until you, until you get to your wireless charging dock. Yes, it charges super fast. We have a lot more to tell you about Gear S2. Gear S2 is a new lifestyle. And to tell you more about that, I would like to invite Elena Cotton. Thank you, everyone. Thank you, Pranav, and thank you, everyone, for that warm welcome. I'm Elena Cotton, and I passionately believe that technology can make people's lives better. And wearables is definitely a category where we can deliver on that promise. Now, imagine, if you will, a life in which your hands are unencumbered by your belongings and the multitude of necessary objects that weigh you down. I want to show you how this wearable will work in the wild. It will help you take charge of your health, get around from place to place, manage your home and car, and help you save money. Okay. Let's start with fitness. Definitely one of my goals is to stay healthy and strong so I can get every moment out of every day. And the Gear S2 is an indispensable partner. And that's whether it's my heart rate or my activity levels, the Gear S2 can automatically recognize and record my stats. It presents vital health data in a circular 24-hour timeline. Green means healthy activity. Yellow means I'm taking it easy. And well, gray means let's get moving. You can rotate the bezel to get more information about each color. So at a glance, I can see, have I been naughty or nice? It informs me. It motivates me. Now, like most of you, I work really, really hard. And this scenario is all too familiar to me. My team and I are locked in a conference room working against the deadline. When the Gear S2 sends a gentle tap to my wrist, it says, inactive for almost an hour. Time to get moving. So we get up from our computers, stretch, and take a break. I suggest a cafe a few blocks away, and the Gear S2 will auto track this walk, and I'll be encouraged along the way. Keep it up. Now, after the break, I can record my coffee intake. I can also track how much water I'm drinking, so I can keep it balanced. Now, somehow, we hit the deadline. And then back home, I can even review my heart rate history at the end of a long and successful day. The Gear S2 has a series of fun and humorous health clocks that help you stay motivated, like the activity sparkle setting. Now, this is performance on the leaderboard, and that's for all of you competitive types. You know who you are. Best of all, the Gear S2 is designed for workout conditions. It's water resistant, so you don't have to worry about getting it all sweaty. Now, imagine that you're on a business trip and you're trying to get to, say, the convention center. You can request an Uber taxi with the Gear S2. You simply turn the app tray, tap to open, and request a car. With every turn, the Gear S2 makes your life easier. If you'd rather take the subway, that's OK. You can also tap and go with the Gear S2 as a transportation car. For now, we have partnerships in Korea 
and the UK. Once you get near the convention center, you might want to stop at the cafe for a snack. And there you can use the coupons that you've saved. With the Gear S2, you can open the FeedMe app and redeem the coupons with a barcode. The barista scans the code on your wearable, and boom, just like that, you're on your way. Sometimes you might take your work to Beijing or Shanghai. There you can use Alipay. OK, at last, a long day of networking and learning about new products comes to an end. You're more than ready to unwind at a local hangout with your friends and colleagues. But after you ordered drinks for everyone, you realize that you've forgotten your wallet in your hotel room, this time not on purpose. But you're not worried because you're wearing your Gear S2. You hold down the back button to open Samsung Pay. You turn the bezel to select your credit card and tap and pay against the NFC terminal. Now, it's your friend's turn to buy the next round. During your business trip, and honestly, any business trip for that matter, you can't wait to get off the road. If you're like me, you install the SmartThings Hub which honestly helps my house feel like a home. Like when I walk through the door, everything just feels right. Soon, I'll be able to sync smart things with my Gear S2. For example, I can check the status of the power of the locks from the smart things app. And even when I'm not home, I can make sure that inter the internal temperature is exactly like I want it. I can also program the app with my own commands like, honey, I'm home, and goodbye, house. So they will automatically turn on and turn off the lights, lock or unlock the doors, just as I wish. That's not all. The Gear S2 will work with the connected car as well. Like, have you ever forgotten to lock your car or couldn't remember where it was parked? I guess that's just me. But the Gear S2 will help you solve these problems by letting you lock, check your locks, control on your car from your wrist, which is amazing. An app will show you where your car is located, turn on the air conditioner before you get there, and if you have an electric car, start and stop the charging of its battery. The Gear S2 also opens up new and exciting possibilities for businesses and industries like healthcare, hospitality, retail, and more. For example, we're talking to global airports and airlines about using wearables to coordinate staff and workflow. And I have to tell you, our ecosystem is strong. We are aligning with major corporate players in commerce, social media, news, fitness, travel, and more, so that the Gear S2 can become a seamless, convenient part of your life. Now, the lifestyle that I just painted for you isn't just a fantasy. It's right around the corner you'll find that the Gear S2 becomes your tool of first response. And when you want to handle more complicated matters, you'll go to your phone. You know, it uh, reminds me of how we check our phones first and then handle any real work on the computer. Think of the Gear S2 as the next evolution in your mobile life. And it keeps getting better with every turn. Thank you, everyone, and please join me in welcoming Youngie Lee back to the stage. So, did you enjoy the GIS2 showcase? Thank you. 
Many of you are probably wondering, when can you get one? Starting from October, the very first Gia S2 will be available to the public. We believe that the Gia S2 will become an intimate extension of your digital life, whether it's controlling your smart home or your connected car, or simply giving you house steps at a glance. It's a category that's rapidly advancing, and Samsung is leading the way. But we humbly know that we can do it alone. Together, we can remove barriers. That's why the Gear S2 is compatible with the other Android devices. <laughs> of course, all of these features do work better when you use it with one of the latest Galaxy phones. At Samsung, we have a lot of things to connect and the smarts to pull it up. In the spirit of boldness, we are planning yet another adventure. Here's a little glimpse of what we mean. experience for a new generation. We'll give you a closer look in October. Before you leave, be sure to check out our exciting experience zones to learn more about how the Gear S2 makes your life better with every turn. And that's it for my presentation. Thank you for your kind attention. Ladies and gentlemen, the product experience is now open. Partners, please stop by the rooftop before heading to the lower level. Media, this is your chance to enjoy the product experience zone in the lower level. Thank you. Dr. Shu. Hey guys, welcome to the continuation of the show. I hope you're enjoying everything so far. I'm John P. And actually, this is Tony. He's going to be our camera operator. Hey, wave hi to all the good folks there. You guys, we normally only allow media into these kind of events. However, because you are so nice to stick around with everybody, we're going to give you the full VIP tour of the Experience Lounge. So come with us. Welcome to the Tempodrome here in beautiful Berlin. The weather is amazing, and we have this amazing facility. Can you believe they built all of this in like one week? It's incredible. You'll see it's a whole circular like coliseum set up here with a lot of different rooms. And of course, we are going to begin in this first room right here where we're gonna feature the star of the show, the Gear S2. You're gonna notice this is a theme. There are all kinds of beautiful watches on display and other toys in these glass cases. And so we've got everything here from uh, the, uh, the normal Gear S2, which is not really normal, to the classic. And we're gonna talk about that in a minute. But 
I want you to see some of the really interesting designs we've got. Over here, we've got the Alessandro Mendini collection. We've got beautiful uh, straps that will go on the watches. And that's not all. <laughs> Heading on over to this side, we've got some static over here. We've got leather straps. We've also got sporty types of straps. And guess what? I've got one on my greedy little arm right here. So I want to show you guys a few of the differences. First of all, this is the normal gear S2. You're going to notice as a clean design, a clean bezel, the beautiful round display. But when we compare it to the classic design, there are a few key differences. Number one, I've got the dark gray version on here, but this also comes in a silver version. You'll notice the classic is black. Now, this one also has a quick detach band, and this one uses a standard wristband, so you can put any kind of wristband on it that you want to. But when it comes to the quick detach, I've got to show you this because it's quite amazing. Hello, everyone. When we pull this off, there's a little button you push, and it just snaps right off, just like that, and right back on. So. What you could do is spice it up, you know, for a night on the town, you wear red or something like that, and then change it back over to something more classic, like let's say black. Oh, and let me show you a couple other little things. The apps, that's what really makes these things special. A quick turn of the dial and we get right into the apps. We can tap it and just scroll through all the apps. But, you know, we'll see more of that as we go through the rest of the zone. So let's fight our way through the crowds here. Let's go. Excuse us, folks. Excuse us coming through. All right, over in this area, it's super packed, so we might not go in there at the moment, but what we're featuring here are the various options you can do with the watch, the, you know, the ways that it interacts with our lives, the health, transportation, connectivity. Again, we're going to see more of that as we get deeper into the show. So let's head on over this way. Oh, oh, this is going to be a favorite over here. We've got a cooking demonstration area. We've actually got a couple of Michelin chefs here who are going to be creating all kinds of goodies for uh, uh, Tony, uh, where are you going? It's not, no, 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 it's not time to eat. No, we'll do that later. No, get away from the food. Come back over here. Come with me. <laughs> In this room, we're actually featuring some of the new Samsung phones. We've got the S6 Edge Plus on this side. We've got the Note 5 over there. And you'll see they're going to be bringing out this beautiful food so everybody can take, uh, you know, food photos, of course, because, you know, that's the most important thing we're going to take pictures of. Let's work our way back this way. There's another back room over here. You know, as we go, I, I, I love this facility. And, you know, there we are up on the big screen. How about that? Also, look at the ceiling. Can you show the guys the ceiling? This, this I mean, it's just amazing. It looks like they should be doing a circus in here or something. Isn't that incredible? And all that rigging was put up in the last week. All right, follow me. We're going to go back here. Oh, here we go. Right back here to the back room. Lots more goodies back here. Lots more. People everywhere. Excuse us, folks. You, uh, Tony, uh, where are you going? No, no. Hang on, hang on. He's like a moth to the flames, guys. Okay, I know that's cool, but come with me over here. Come on, let's, let's go this way first. We'll come back to that, I promise. Come on. Excuse me, guys. Excuse me. Let's start over here, okay? Because we've got all kinds of accessories being showcased here on the wall. You know, one of the things that I really enjoy about Samsung products in general is that you can always get plenty of accessories, whatever you need. If you want cases, if you want headphones, if you want chargers, they've got it all. And we can't say that for every manufacturer, but good stuff here. Moving over this direction, we come to one of my favorite sections, Samsung Pay. Now, if you're not familiar with Samsung Pay, imagine this. Leave your wallet at home, leave your credit cards at home because what you're going to be able to do is take one of these new phones and when, when you see one of these credit card processing terminals, you'll just hold it up beside it 
and bam, your transaction will go through. No credit card necessary. And soon, we'll do the same thing with our watch. Just swipe the watch, pay your bill, and keep on going. Okay, now we can show them the magnificent wall here. Isn't this crazy, folks? We have 238 S6 Edge Pluses all working in harmony as one giant display. I, I mean, it's just a work of art, but it's super, super impressive. Continuing on our journey here, this is the connected car display. You may be thinking to yourself, why do we have a car in the middle of a Samsung event? Well, it's very simple because there are going to be car apps that you can put on your watch. Now, I want you to imagine this. Let's say you go shopping and it's like burning hot outside. You know that when you get back to your car, it's gonna be an absolute oven in there. Okay, no problem. Pull up your watch, fire up your car app and start the car before you get there. Cool it off, it'll be ready for you. So very, very nice. Continuing on our journey over here, we've got a number of bikes. The reason why is because we're featuring the S Health apps and all the functionality that comes with fitness. So let me give you a little bit of a demonstration. I have been wearing my watch today and let's take a look at how I'm doing. So we can scroll on over and we can see a few things. First of all, here's my heart rate. I took that right before we started. 74 beats a minute, not too shabby, huh? You know, I'm not having to carry that big rig like Tony. So uh, we also have my steps, 15,000 steps today. I'm at 250%. These guys need to give me a break. And we can see totals. So about an hour of really strenuous exercise, eight hours of additional stuff. And we can see it on a calendar basis, et cetera. So it's gonna aggregate all, all that data and make sure we're really staying healthy, you know? Okay, let's keep going. You'll notice also behind us, there are all these stations. We can't even get to them anymore because everyone is playing with all the new phones and watches. We're gonna make our way back out into the main area up front. You know, one of the things that I really love is this double mirror passageway here. I think it's super cool uh, it's kind of freaky when you're going through it, but it's really beautiful. Plenty of people to work through. Excuse us, folks. Sorry, coming through. Okay, this is great, okay? This is the multimedia room, and the first thing you see are like a bunch of space-age pods. Let's see if we can work our way back in here. Although these little chairs are super comfortable. I mean, you would think that you'd think they'd be a little awkward, but you know what? In fact, I'm, I'm going I'm to take a load off here, you know? Oh yeah, oh, that's nice, super nice. I'm gonna get some of these from my house. Here's what we're looking at, folks. It's the Gear VR headset. If you've never seen one of these before, this is a 3D kind of virtual reality world. And what you do is you pop one of these phones right into the front. It just snaps in place, put it on your head, and it's like having a giant screen right in front of your eyes, but with one big difference because when you move your head, the image changes, it tracks in this virtual world. Super, super cool. That is the future, my friends. Okay, continuing on over this way. Okay, here's something you don't see every day. It's a silent disco. Listen, you don't hear anything, but excuse us folks, we're gonna sneak through here. We actually have a band over here and a DJ, all of this going on, even though you can't hear it. But let me see, let me see how this is doing here. Oh yeah, they're jamming. This sounds awesome. I'm listening to this on the new Samsung Level On Wireless Pro headphones. Here, you wanna take a listen? Psych, can't do that, sorry. <laughs> okay, let's see if we can find our way back through the crowd here. Excuse me, guys, sorry. They're all connected to the latest collection products. Okay, for those of you whose thing is passion, uh, fashion, you have a passion for fashion, we have a whole room here. We'll see if we can sneak through here. 
and we can definitely get you blinged out, okay? Starting over on this side, we've got all kinds of goodies from Swarovski. So check this out. I mean, if you want to go a, a sparkly night out on the town, there's nothing like encasing your uh, phone in diamonds. So that will do it. Then if we want to move over to the other side here, sneaking by everybody, sorry, we're going to sneak right behind you. <laughs> We've got the Mont Blanc collection over here. Very classic designs, you know, black leather, just beautiful, matches your Mont Blanc pins. This would look great in a pocket right beside that pin, I'll tell you what. And over in the middle, if we can make our way through, excuse me, guys, excuse me, sorry. We've got the opening ceremony gear, and this stuff is a collection that's designed for Samsung in, co in connection with opening ceremony will get you cases and things that will go along with your opening ceremony clothing and shoes and the whole line. So very, very nice. Now, all of this reminds me that these products have to be built by someone and they're being built by craftsmen. These people are very experienced and they go through a lot of pain and suffering to make it work. So I wanna see if we can get through here to show you what happens. Excuse me, guys, I'm sorry. Can we just sneak in here for one second? I just want to show them this, uh, this lineup right here real quick. What happens is we start with a single block of aluminum, and that thing has to be machined all the way down to an individual frame. Plus, take a look at all these components in the back. Imagine sandwiching all of those together to fit them into one phone. That's what we have to do, and this is what the result of all that machining is. One simple little device, pure craftsmanship. So that's it, that's our tour. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Um, we are going to let you share this on social media. Give us a thumbs up, head on over to youtube.com forward slash Samsung Mobile, and for Tony and myself and all of the rest of the team here, thanks for watching, have a good day. Thank mm -hmm. you.